Now let's look at another problem where we're going to be working with a normal distribution and percentages associated with it. Use the z-scores and the corresponding percentiles shown below to solve this exercise. Test scores are normally distributed with a mean of 74 and a standard deviation of 10. What percentage of the scores are above 88? Let's sketch out a picture to see what we're dealing with. We have a normal distribution. In the middle of that normal distribution, we're going to place our mean of 74. The other value that we're interested in is the score of 88, which we can see is larger than 74, so we're going to place it to the right of 74 on our chart. Now, we want to find the percentage of scores that are above 88, so on our graph, this is going to correspond to the area under the curve to the right of 88. To figure out what that percentile is going to be, we're going to end up taking our z-score for 88. We'll find that by taking 88 minus 74, which is our mean, and dividing that by the standard deviation of 10. The difference is 14. Dividing by 10 gives us 1.4. Now, we're going to use the chart to find out that the percentile related to 1.4, a z-score of 1.4, is 91.92. What that's telling us is that if we take all of the score, all of this area under the curve that's to the left of that score, that would be 91.92 percent. So if we're now interested in what's going on to the right, then we're going to take our 100 percent, which would include everything, and subtract from it the 91.92 percent to come up with the percentage that will be under the curve to the right of 88. So this area is going to be representing 8.08% .08 of the scores.